Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, this is to talk about a couple of things. First of all, the Patch Tuesday updates that are rolling out are uh, seem to be going well. Um, one thing that has been popping up, the comments of quite a few people that say that um, if they were hit by the uh, famous um, you know, AMD CPU slowdown, because if you're on an AMD chip, some of you might have slowdowns on your machine. Like I said, and many of you have commented the same, I don't see any difference on my PC, or it doesn't seem like it. But it uh, also is very unique in the way that it actually presents itself. So it seems to depend on maybe what you actually do with your PC. But it seems that the Patch Tuesday update have made this worse. A lot of uh, people have been commenting that uh, it's even slower now. But the good news is that Microsoft has issued um, a statement saying that the fix for the uh, Ryzen CPU speed problems or slowdowns uh, is going to be released on October the 21st. So that would be apparently October 21st. Some say October 19th, some say October 21st. One of both. But the first report I've seen was October 21st. There will be an update. And I would guess that update is not just going to fix that. There's probably going to be a broad list of fixes on that day for multiple things. Um, maybe even for that file explorer problem so um, for those that are are commenting on the file explorer you don't see the problem you have to open multiple windows of file explorer for this to happen if you open just one and go into the folders you won't notice any problem but the memory leak problem where it uses one gigabyte is when you start opening several file explorer windows and those are the people that are actually noticing that there's a runaway process going on there um, so for the, uh, fixes, there will be a definitely bug fixing update coming up this month as we uh, see. So within a week ish of, uh, today, we should have some fixing for that problem. Obviously a few problems, you know, as, as a new operating system is rolling out, a lot of people mention, you know, I'm waiting. I don't want to have the first version. I want to wait because, uh, that's, you know, there's always problems with the, the first versions of Windows. And so we see them popping up here and there. And last but not least, for all of those still, um, you know, going crazy over the fact that you don't see it and you're compatible, it's totally normal. There's no problem there. Um, it's not because you're compatible that you see Windows 11 and Windows Update. It's really a very slow process going on right now. So Microsoft is really just, you know, choosing a certain selection of PCs and pushing it there for people to install as they're taking their time to see if anything abnormal is happening or if something's going wrong. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.